Hello guys and gals and welcome to Gold Rush 2022. Today we are going to be starting from the beginning from the hotel. So stick around, I'll be right back. Okay, guys and gals, and welcome back to a new year and a new gold rush. We are playing in regular mode. Um, right now, I'm putting hard mode on hold because it hasn't been getting that many views. So I'm just playing plain old gold rush. And we're going to see what we do and how we can do things. So... I'm showing you right now where all three stories are. There's one over there, one over here, and one over there. And these stories get you like one cent off a gallon at the gas station. So let's go ahead and drive into town. game is very laggy. It's not my computer. 2019 is when I bought my computer. And it's a very fast computer. It has a i9 and something. 10th generation something. It was the highest um, Intel processor at the time. And I have a 2020. Uh, a 2080 TF a GE4 RTX that's a gas station if you're new to this game so if you haven't problems playing this game it's this because this game is old that's the water tower where you can buy water and we are going to go to the bank And I'll hop out. We need to lease some property so we can start digging. So you got parcels here. This is the bank. You got parcels here that you can lease or buy. These are the loans that you can take. This is the stock stock price of gold. And if you got gold bars, this is where you sell them. So what we are doing. So back to the parcels. We got Old Arnold Parcel. We have River Town. We have Pine Valley. And we got Nighthawk. And we go back to Old Arnold. Old Arnold costs zero to lease, but it does cost you 30. If you take a look at this, right now, price per square foot is $60, which means it's hundred thousand dollars to buy additional uh, appreciation on the rent is 30 percent of the gold you take out of the ground that does not count the gold nuggets you collect this counts the gold you take out of the ground this area is roughly 10,000 square feet and the amount of gold is low uh, digging in the parcel doesn't cost you anything. Water source, large creek. Owner is Old Arnold. And tells you a little bit about this, that, and the other thing. So we'll go ahead and lease that. And we'll come back. Lease the break. And we'll come here. Pop out. Turn off the engine, yeah. We're going to need two buckets. Oh, crap. I forgot to get something. Let's go back to the bank real quick. I wasn't finished with the bank because I forgot to do something. Because I'm going to play this a little easier than what I normally do. This is going to save me time. 
So for right now, I'm going to run over to the bank real quick. I almost got it. Wasn't going fast enough. I am going to take out a one-time loan, and it's going to be twelve hundred. It's going to cost me one thousand seven hundred and thirty-six dollars to pay it back. So when you take loans out, be be aware of how much it's going to cost you overall, how much it's going to interest payments daily of five hundred and seventy-nine dollars. Since I'm taking it out in three months, you can expand it if you a month, but interest rate goes up a uh, high you take out for 24 months or 24 days okay take out for 24 days interest rate goes up to about 145 percent right now we're at 20 21 percent back to the store um Oh, great. Thank you. All right. Now <laughs> we get things going here. Okay, we already got the... Need one jerry can. And when you order, I'll show you again. You got to come over here. However many you want, just click on there. This tells you how many spots you have available to buy. Because the area will get filled and you click add. I'm gonna need one thin garden hose. That's it from that aisle. We're gonna need one diesel pump. If you buy this pump, well, first of all, it's extremely high, but then you also have to have this to run that. That's electric, diesel, cheaper. We'll get one hog pan extension, one hog pan core. And you got two hog pan no pump or hog pan with pump, and we're gonna get the one with the pump. One of those, and we need four minor mops, a hog pan mat. Excuse me, hog pan mat. Four of those. Gonna come over here and it's gonna ah take this money. Oh wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. That's something very important to protect the pump. We need that. We need the water filter. Which is right here for $99. What this does it filters the water coming into the hose, keep dirt and debris out, and which will help your um, water pump last longer. Don't need to do that again. So we come over to here. All our stuff is right here. So let's put the small stuff first. And what we'll do is come over here, connect that to the big red hose, that hose, or whatever it's called. That on that hog pan. And the reason why I'm putting the hog pan mats in right now instead of just tossing the hog pan, the, the mats in the back of the truck, this way I can carry three items at once instead of one item at a time once we get back to camp. This near the back of the hose, back of the thing, and I'm just going to pop it in there like that. That way I can fill it up without having to take it out. But, um, grab the engine. And... Engine right there. We'll grab the hog pan with pump. That right there. Grab these buckets. Oh yeah, this game is dark. You do have a flashlight, so I can pump in and turn it on. So you can see a little bit better. Um, white buckets on this white background. It's kind of hard, at least for me, to see. Okay. Next we'll take up the big hose. 
and then the small hose. And then we'll take the hog pan core, pick that up, just like that. And we'll pick up the extension, move it over to this side of here. Goes in, it's in. Hop into the truck. Oh, wait a minute. Double check, make sure you got everything. Because <laughs> sometimes I forget. <laughs> And you don't want to get all the way to the parcel and find out you left something at the store. Um, we'll go ahead and drive to the gas station now. And get some fuel. Gas here is very high. And since right now we're on one time speed, which is real time. So every minute in the game is one minute in real time. Only time I speed up the game is when I actually have to smell gold. I don't want to wait 15 minutes every day all the time. Maybe once I get things done, I'll hop out here. Grab this. Fill this up. And you can see gas is 10.69 a gallon. Cost me 50 dollars. Fill up the pump. Pump cost me 13.56 to fill. And let's fill up the pickup truck. Okay, as of right now, we got $677 left. Okay. One other thing I want to try. I'm going to see if it works. They've updated it. I want to see if it works a little bit better. I'm trying my hand at modding in this game. Making a skin this pickup truck and once I figure out how to make the skin for the pickup truck I'll uh, try to make the skin for the other vehicles and other equipment. If not, I'm going to go with the old gold mining Irish gold mining company. Just another mod. So let's pull into here. Stop. Turn off the engine. Save gas. We're going to come over here to the paint shop. And what the paint shop lets you do is you can pick these pre-made stuff or you can go to the Steam Workshop in the Goldbush community and go ahead and click that. User. Receive that. Oh, back. Sure. Yeah, that's about as far as I got. This say mining company. It's supposed to say, "Buddy, 1927 gold mining is here," but it came across there. It's supposed to have my logo here, it doesn't. So I got to figure out what I'm doing here and go from there. So we'll go back to the workshop. Go with the classic. Irish Gold Mining Company. Yes, I'm Irish. Nice white pickup truck. So what I'm going to do is meet you at the parcel. See you there. Okay, guys. I, I forgot. Uh, we're going to go to the factory first. We're coming up on it right now. What I'm going to do is show you the stories in the factory. We go from there. So what we do is we'll stop here. Turn off the engine, hop out. Maybe not. And we'll start on this side. Come over here to the gate. 
see that little sock that tells you that there's something there and there it is there's one there's seven stories here what i like doing is just going down here this kind of check because sometimes they move them there was an update just before the end of the year i haven't played this game in a while except for the hardcore mode there's the other one So, during this series, I will show you where all the story. We'll try to find all the stories for you. So, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button and bell. That way you know when the latest Gold Rush comes out. I want, there's one right around here somewhere. Alright, there it is. Come over to here. There it is. There's one behind under the tire. Yeah. Yeah. So, if you like these videos, do me a favor. Hit that like button. Every like I get helps support this channel. and helps my channel be seen on YouTube. I would really appreciate that. Sorry, somewhere around here. There it is over this way we'll go on the other side this place is where you turn in you end up parking your um magti trailer here and what you do is put one of your magti through this and it gets dumped into here we'll talk more about that up in in the next couple of videos one on following this you can jump up on the cars you just can't go where they don't want you to go no it's here somewhere can tell because it's blinking like crazy. See, I move away, it slowly blinks. As I get closer, it's blinking like crazy, and I don't see this stuff. Right ah, there it is. I think that's the last one. We, if you ever want to See what your stories are about and you want to read them. Click your journal and click stories and tell it gives you a brief history. Remember you're saving the hotel. We collected three there. This one, two, three, four, five. I'm sorry, there's five in this. It used to be seven. There's five stories in this thing. So we'll post old Arnold. So now I want to show you where the old Arnold ones are. Now, like I said, you save like a penny off off on gas. So right now we're saving each story. There's lots of stories out here. This is the parcel, and we're going to turn left right here. And let's drive until we can't drive no more. That's about here. We'll turn that off. We'll hop out. The truck ain't rolling. Remember to break on. We'll just go down this path here. So we find a tent. Once we find the tent, there it is. There's a story right here. Now, I'm not going to read these stories. If you play the game, go ahead and read the stories yourself. I'm showing you where the locations are. It doesn't take too much time. Okay, so what we are going to do next is back up. And then make a left. And we're coming on 
Watch out for the rock right there and the fence. Okay, this building here, this is store, indoor, indoor storage. Got the, you can park vehicles in here for the winter time and other pieces of equipment you can park in here. And you got shelves to store items and stuff like that. Okay, I'm going to show you this area. This, and this is called the service area. If you ever lease a vehicle and you're done with it, you park it here and you go to, or you want to sell a vehicle, you just go to the cash register and it will sell it or at least turn it back to where you leased it from. This dumpster, you put your broken parts or unwanted items in here and sometimes you get money back oh yeah this is your outdoor storage area good place for items that won't be able to freeze like uh, chains and items like this this is where if you order stuff from the store from the lap from the tablet this is where it comes. We have not unlocked it, and I'll go over that a little bit more in detail once we unlock it. And then we'll just drive up here. I'm going to park right here, turn off the engine. I'm going to start up here. This area here is where you put your wash plant. And we'll get into this area. That's the parcel right there. This is your trailer. Just come to the door, press E. You can sleep for how many hours? You'll sleep till dawn. I'm not going to sleep right now. But if you want time to pass and to sleep through the night, do that. This is the gold tent. And we're just going to put this up here because we're not going to do. That's for panning, and I'm not going to pan gold. I'm going to take this bucket here for right this second. Take the pan. I'm, I have other videos to show you how to pan my other series. I'm just going to take this bucket, and we're going to run over here. This is the hog pan area. We'll take this out, run it through your hog pan. There's gold in there. Start off with oh yeah the other story this stuff is right here at, at this fence post and those are the two stories for that take these two buckets this goes there come up here up this one this is the core hog pan It'll highlight where you need to put it, press E, and it goes in. Pick up the extension next. Okay, don't run into the fence. And put that there. Take care of these buckets real quick. Get some of the hog pan areas set up. We need to get everything out of here and get everything set up so we have access to everything. And hog pan with the pump. That goes right there. It shows you where to place it once you get close to it. Grab this. Grab that. Yeah. Okay. And what I, where I put mine, right here, cause 
later on we're going to be setting up this gold room with other equipment that's going to need water and it's a lot easier to set it there grab this one this on the back of the pump run this to the creek and I like putting mine right there at the end of the where the waterfall meets the creek I mean, yeah, I forgot to go over the pump. That's the back of the pump where you connect the big hose. This is where you start it and stop it. Oop, wrong way. Need one more piece. Actually, two more pieces. This. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep mine right there. And what we do with this is connect that and connect that to that. So we got everything set up. So let's go ahead and start the pump. This red button here is where you start. Uh, stop it and you got a little handle over here. You see how it's highlighted you press E Start the pump water starts flowing through there. Now you can start digging you use your shovel and Put the dirt in the hog pan I like doing Try to get as far away as possible. From the off pan area. I do this if, if I'm doing the whole thing, I just like doing it like that. And keep on digging. Okay, now we found a gold nugget. Now we have the option to either keep the nugget or reject it. If you reject it, you won't find no more nuggets. If you keep it, you'll find more nuggets. And like I said in the beginning, we're leasing this with a zero dollar down lease. But 30% of the gold that we recover from the ground goes to old Arnold. But the nuggets do not count as that 30%. That's actually free gold. Or free money is what I call it. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and keep it. And I got a lot of digging to do here. What I'm going to do, you see how this thing works any which way. What I'm going to do is bring you back when we are ready. You see the percentage of the, as I put the dirt in here, you see the percentage of dirt that's actually in the mat. And once that gets full, we have to clean out the mat. So I'll bring you back when we got that all done. Oh, found another nugget. So we're up to 1.443 ounces of gold. Okay guys, the hog pan is full, so what I like to do, instead of just running over there, turn off the pump, since we're in real time, we don't use that much gas, what I'll do is come over here, pick up a bucket, 
I'll bring it over here because it's a little easier over here. And what I'm going to do is take this hose. And you can see where it clicks onto the bucket. And we're going to fill the bucket up. Okay, the bucket is now full. I'm just going to bring this over here. Then just about that there. Then we're going to take the mat. And we're going to dunk in, dunk them into, wash them into this bucket. Oh. There we go. You see the difference? That's clean. That's dirty. we we'll do this four, three more times. Oops. My hand shakes a little bit, so I do apologize. For missing. Watch that. Put this back. Watch this. And you can only put four hog pan mats into one bucket. This bucket is now full. I'm just going to move it over here to... I'm going to call this place the Gold Room. And we'll just put this bucket here. And what I'm going to do next is continue digging. So uh, turn that on. And just continue digging. Fill this up three more times. So we have a total of four buckets to process. And what I instead of this bringing you back in forth I'm going to do this off camera and go ahead and let's start our next episode which will be the gold room I'm going to show you how to set up the gold room and what you need to set up the gold room is what we got so if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button and bell. That way you know when the latest videos I do come along and when I go live here on YouTube. Also do me a favor, hit that like button. If you like, I get those support for the channel, which helps this channel be seen a little bit more on YouTube, which helps it grow. And I would really appreciate that. And as always, have fun playing your games. Be safe out there in the world, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.